All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm your host for today's broadcast, Insane Leader 13. And now that we have completed the normal story mode, well, it's not normal, but the professional story mode, now we are going to do a run through of separate ways. Um, I've only, unlike the base game, which I've completed about 30 times, 30, maybe 31 times now, uh, I've only ever completed separate ways once. And that was on Xbox when I first, very, the very, very first time I got this game. So, yeah. Um, I don't really remember much about this. I remember really not caring for this much, though. You know, I felt it was very meh, but not bad. I do also remember all the cutscenes are incredibly fucking muddy and murky, so sorry about that. But, uh, we don't have a difficulty slider. I would, if this was, like, the modern Resident Evil 4 remake, I would have the difficulty set to professional. But, I don't, so we're not. Anyways, uh, let's go. Okay, you don't need to talk to me like that, game. The only reason I've taken on this mission is to get closer to my own objective. No matter what happens, I can't let anyone figure that out. Of course, hiding in the shadows isn't my style. I'll have to reveal myself to him and offer advice once in a while. So I see you've managed to arrive at the village on time. Yes, but nobody remembered to roll out my red carpet. The villagers there are all being controlled. They automatically attack any intruders. Ring the church bell. That should quiet them down for a while. Hmm. <laughs> Sounds like they're good, obedient boys and girls. Unfortunately, time is not a luxury we have. Gather as much information as you can about the parasites and finish off this little tour. Chapter one, ring the church bell. All right. So, according to this map, which appears to be Aztec in origin, you are here. Without mucus, your stomach would digest itself. All right. Oh, I actually have a knife in this mode. Whoa! My goodness, that. that was incredible. But there is nothing there, of course. Ow. Fuck off! I'm trying to do way too many fucking tricks, and that's not gonna help me with anything. Oh, I have a shotgun already. Okay, nice. I 
shotgun. Let me reload this. Because if memory serves correctly, you don't actually have the ability to... Uh... I need to find some regular herbs also, so... Let's go ahead and do a bit of exploring while I'm doing this, and hopefully Leon will take most of the heat away from me. Is there still a shotgun at the end of this? There is not. There is something on the side there. What is that? That is spinel. All right, I'll take that. I won't complain about that for sure. Handgun bullets, absolutely. Sorry, Leon, but um, my survival means more to me than you gain out of here, okay? Chicken egg, absolutely. Actually, I'll eat the chicken egg now. Also, start reorganizing my inventory now as well. I don't even remember all the weapons that Ada gets. I know is there. I know what she. You've got what she has right now, obviously. Alright, fine. Come on over here. If it's just one of you, I have no concern. Oh, there's three of you. Okay. Uh, there are way fewer people in this than there was in the main story. I don't know if that's because of a hardware limitation. A shotgun. I better leave this for Leon. Okay. That's, kind, that's a kind thing of you to think. Yeah, there are way, way fewer people in the village here in Ada's little story than there are in actual story. And that's catching me more than a little bit off guard. Come on, let's run around and grab everything we can. Wow, Ada is actually kind of slow at uh, pushing stuff around. I can respect that. What are you trying to tell me about up there? How do I even get up there? Oh wow, that's a lot of them. Okay, so here's where they all were hanging out at. So overdone with your style. I appreciate, I can always appreciate style. But you are absolutely uh, overcooked. Oh, Halo, that's how you do it. Okay. 
Chelsea. Can I jump down wherever I want, or do I have to do it from there? I guess I have to do it from here. Bastard off of me. Thank you. I'm not done looking around here, boys, so just wait a bit, okay? Okay, so yellow herbs, that would be nice. Red herbs still there. Is there still handgun bullets right over here? Not look like it. Fuck you. Uh, I've already been inside that house. Let's go inside this house real quick and see if there's anything of value in here. Boy, chainsaw guy's having a hell of a fucking time by the sound of it. There's nothing unusual here. Yeah, I didn't need you to double check that. Oh, okay, I didn't see you right on me there. Sorry about that, my friends. Here, I'll just jump on out. Here, I'll leave you to that, okay? There's only one area left I can think of that I should check before I leave. We're not on hard mode, so I can afford. I can actually take a little bit, not a lot more, but a little bit more damage. So I feel like I can do a little bit of exploring. Uh, I know if I try to go after wherever Leon is, the game will say some fuck off. Okay, fuck both of you. Sincerely. Also, I'm just gonna combine this with this. And put this right here. I'm gonna go ahead and put this here. Actually, I have more red herbs and green herbs. That's a rarity. Alright, come on, boys. Play these little fuck fuck games are definitely not helping me in any way that matters. There goes Leon one more time. Game's already given me the insignia key, so I'm. Yes, I already know. The game's already given me the insignia key, so we're heading on through. All right, stranger. Um, who the hell are you? Welcome. That's probably Ada's reaction. We know who he is. Ada should Got know. Got a selection of. Good things on sale, I'm not open stranger. yet. As you can see, I don't have my blue torches set up. But I suppose the customer comes first. Sell me some treasure and buy what some weapons. Selling? No, I can sell some spinels. Is that all straight? That's really it. <laughs> Thank what do you buy? What do you have? Mission one treasure map. I'm probably gonna need Is to that get that. <laughs> so let's buy that Thank now. You. I'm not gonna bother with the TMP. I don't feel that there's any real value in that for now. I might need it later, but. 
Uh, I don't even have a normal rifle, so the semi auto scope is kind of pointless for me. Getting the rifle now is tempting, but I don't have the money for it, so... I think for now it's just going to be just the treasure Come map. Back anytime. So let's check the treasure map. Um, Alright, well I already got the treasures in the last area, obviously, so... All right. Die already. God, that's fucking annoying. I mean, I'll take the egg. I'm happy for the egg, but like, good lord, it should not have taken that much to get that thing killed. I didn't even remember that there were snakes in fucking Ada's story. Okay, and the little, uh, drop-down thing is not there. Nice. Oh, wow, okay, so I guess the, uh... Anything you will not, okay. There's just really not as much stuff around here as I thought there would be, huh? I mean, the game gave me some ammo and stuff. Also, as you can see, uh, Ada doesn't get the chance to upgrade any of her weapons. Oh! Okay, fuck. Got you made your point. So I do know that one thing that Ada has is that she has to find the yellow cat's eye and put it in the little lock thing. the uh, birds and get anything out of that. Oh wow, that bird dropped healing. Uh, 
I want you guys to come and engage me on my terms. So, yeah, come over here. You know you see me. Come on. I'm waiting on you, boys. Anytime. I'm sipping tea in your hood. Drop anything, of course. All right, come on, dress in the red, bitch. Okay, that explains why I need to put the cat's eye in there. So let's find the fucking cat's eye first. instead of yourself. handgun ammo a little faster than I'd like, but the fact that everything's a lot spunkier is definitely gonna help me out here. Give me that egg. Nothing. Useless. Pathetic. Useless. Worthless. I don't want to knock the Rampaging Chainsaw Woman off of the fucking edge of the fucking bridge. So I'm going to bring her somewhere to where I know I can't accidentally shoot her off the edge. Don't need to go crazy with this. I have a shotgun and plenty of shells. Come and get it. If you're ready, come and get it. Nah, nah, nah. nah. Use your aggressive feelings, woman.
you down so you're not an issue for me. You are so hyper dramatic when you pump that shotgun. I like it, I appreciate it, but uh, man, I, you are really over dramatic. Alright, here we go, come on. Well, I guess it makes that pretty clear for you then, doesn't it, Ada? Also, I keep thinking that Ada has long hair, even though she very obviously doesn't. It's not like, oh god, graphics are bad. Like, no, you can very obviously and plainly see that she just has something wrapped around her neck that's hanging off the back. But it's just close enough to her normal hair color that I keep thinking, oh, that's her actual hair color. I'm a, I'm a fucking idiot, if you can't tell. I want to check something real quick here. I think there are two bird's nests in this little hole. I want to double check to make sure. No, there's only one. Okay, I'm actually out of my mind. Equip the handgun. You can move, run faster with the gun. Can you go into this side door out of curiosity? It won't bud. It's locked from the other side, of course. Now right, let's put the green cat's eye in here. Shashka. Need some handgun ammo, little folks. Let's just go ahead and throw this to make some good use here. <laughs> Fuck off! Yes, I know. I happen to already have something that's round to fit in here, so... Okay. Huh. Hello, y'all! We squirrels are doing something called... Hibernation, and we don't want to be disturbed. Why is the music so hyper dramatic? 
I am in a church. I am not in Jason's basement. Knife only kill, boys. Oh, nice, purple gun. Alright, let's combine that right now. Climb up, 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 and away. Oh, wow, hello, fuck off. Now the hyper dramatic music is over. I don't know why the heck it was so bloody over dramatic. Door won't open. It's locked. I hear someone whimpering on the other side. Yeah, well, Ada doesn't have the uh, ovaries to open the door, so. Mmm. Oh, this is interesting. The symbol is upside down now. Huh. Nice. Oh, la campana. So is that supposed to imply that Leon was holding off the entirety of the village for like, whatever, 30 minutes or so that took? Yeah, 25, 30 minutes that took. Because that seems really insane. And I was most definitely taking my slow ass time. Lord Sattler. Where's everyone going? Bingo? Yeah. Killed 61. I do not feel like I killed 61 enemies. I feel like I may have only killed like half of that. Here's what I know so far. Osmond Sadler's cult is known as Los Illuminados. They've resurrected some sort of parasitic organism they call Las Plagas. That's all my organization knows for sure. Though Sadler's occult activity seems of investigation. The Salazar family, Castellans for generations, possessed the ability to control Las Plagas. The organization's hypothesis is that a unique frequency of sonic wave sensed only by the parasites is used to control them. The same principle used in dog whistles. This was inferred through the analysis of a tissue sample we retrieved. The tissue contained an organ presumably used for sensing sound waves. 
I've seen cult members carrying ceremonial rods, and I wonder if they emit these sounds. Of course, this is purely theoretical. The organization needs samples of the parasite to confirm or disprove these theories. That is the main objective of my mission, and the only way to prove my loyalty to the organization. The opening moves in this chess game have been played. There's no turning back now. It's literally just a... Among all the people involved in this, Luis Serra has the least entanglements. He works for no organization, preferring to move on his own. I'm the one who told the organization of his importance. I did it because I like him. His history betrays an enthusiasm I once shared. It was a stroke of luck that I happened to intercept his email for help. It seems he can't trust the police, so he sent the email to an old friend from college. He must have thought his friend was still alive. At any rate, that's how I managed to find him. Apparently, he's been conducting his own investigation of the cult while doing research on Las Plagas. A brilliant scientist. He's accumulated a pile of data and pieced it all together. Must be why Sadler hired him. Hmm. Too bad Sarah's snooping has aroused his suspicion. When I told him who I was, he practically begged to be taken into custody. He needed protection. He said, I have no love for Las Plagas or this stupid cult I want out. I just want peace and quiet again. I ordered him to bring me a Master Plaga specimen, a sample for evidence. Looks like he's one of the few people whom Sadler actually trusts. Tracking him down and getting my hands on the sample shouldn't be difficult. I doubt the cult will take kindly to his escape, though. I'll have to guide this along if I want it to go smoothly. I'm going to come back to the reports later and see if these reports are like automatically given at the end of each, uh... I think the reports might automatically be given at the end of each chapter that you complete. And Ada's story only has five chapters, so... I think her story only has five chapters. Waiting for it to automatically go, but I had to manually push the button and move it on. We have an irregularity. The researcher we planted has been discovered by the Illuminados. He must be talking about that vagrant Spaniard. So where is he now? He's held captive in an abandoned house located northeast of the village. Until he recovers the sample, we can't let him die. You don't need to remind me. Luis, Sarah. And I thought I was high maintenance. Okay. No, open it. Thank you. No, okay. Jesus Christ, were you just staring at me awkwardly Welcome. this entire time? Oh, stranger. You got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. What that are sounds you great. Selling? I have something to sell you, though. Ah. <laughs> what are you buying? Is that all? <laughs> Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Not you got enough. that rifle also? Fuck. Okay. Come back at any time. I might come back to buy the rifle later. 
Let me adjust my inventory. Well, actually, no, my inventory is pretty close to what I actually will need it to be anyway, so. Let me check the map here. hitting the wrong button yeah okay definitely a good thing to head backwards here I know in Leon's story, you can let the thing fall into the well, and he'll still pick it up. He'll just, it just won't be worth as much. For Ada, she will only pick it up if you make sure it doesn't fall into the dirty water. Take care of Mr. Cool first. All right, curses, fine, whatever. And my shotgun's already fully loaded also. All right, let's go. I got something to sell to you. you Not much, just a spinel <laughs> and a brass pocket watch. <laughs> what are you buying? Is that old? <laughs> Thank you. Don't need a scope for it. I might get the TMP at some point. I don't know. I know Ada is, wields a TMP by the end of Leon's story, so it's tempting to get. And it's not like I'm saving uh, cash to upgrade weapons. The weapons you start out with are the ones you basically have. You don't get to upgrade any, at any point. Hello? Why are you hanging out in here? Anyways, back to what I was doing. Raiding this place. Why are you at a urine? You're a woman. I I'm pretty sure you're a woman. I don't see how you're gonna use that. Maybe I'm just stupid, but uh don't see how you can get much use out of that lady. Ooh, golden chicken egg, yes please. Oh, some things stay the same. Fuck you. Nice. 
Like I said, more things change, the more they have to say the same. This little section, everyone's literally laid out in the same order they are when Leon comes through later. Actually, I should probably move this to here. Put this here. Put this there. There, I'm a little happier now. Watch this VT and PMO. Told you so. Wow, every single one I missed. this now and I'll eat one of these has not gone quite as good as I hoped it would but well hello there's still a few of you left I'm gonna have plenty of ammo for the TMP when I finally get to that point. And I'm back here already. Put the rifle ammo there, but uh, thank you. Hello. Don't know why they put a egg in there, but okay. Yeah. 
Well, you boys are taking a slow, easy fucking time, aren't you? There's only two of you? Really? Fuck off. Seriously, how are there only two of you? I never did check up here when I was here the first time, so let me see if there's anything up here that's worth grabbing. Yeah, I'll take that. I see an egg over there, let's grab that. The egg is gone, fucking hell. nice of the villagers to replenish all the stuff that I took earlier. Alright, not all the stuff, I guess. Just check the map. No, there's no treasures or anything here. Okay. Use your aggressive feelings, boy. Let the hate flow through you. Come on, Ada. There's a lot of shotgun shells they're giving me. It's kind of freaking me out a bit. Like, I have... 26 shotgun shells right now. You only need to put one shell in there. You do not need to put two in there. Just saying. Wait to get out of here. Ah, uh, you said it, Ada, not me. Fuck, come on. You, Ada, need a Penzetamine subscription even more than the others. Come on. Oh, 
Oh shit, I didn't realize you were right there. Why are there so many? Let's eat this real quick. I'm just gonna keep doing this. is overpowering, yeah, you can say that again. This has been like ultra fucking low stakes, it feels like. I don't know, I feel like there's been like almost no risk of seriously dying unless I'm playing like a complete idiot. Not really a bad thing considering this is like a bonus, this is not the main game itself. That. Also, the ammo qual the ammo quantity seems feels like it's a lot lower, as well to compensate for the fact that we just have less uh, enemies. Maybe I'm just reading too much into it, though. Nice gold bank. this which way do I have to go oh both ways uh, have a way to go apparently but one's locked and it'll take the long way to get this way so say if you try to go through this. Barred from the other side. Alright. All right, I see something over there. If that's an egg, I want that egg now. Nope, I'm losing my mind. I'm losing my sight, losing my mind. Wish somebody would tell me I'm fine. Does Ada have quick time events? I don't remember if she does or not. What a disturbing signpost. Right, I mean, I guess that's one th way to think of things. Did you really just walk by without... No, there we are.
Ow, fuck you both. Alright, this is where we eat a brown egg. Pointless bridge just hanging over here with absolutely nothing for it. This is fucking ridiculously pointless. And the other guy didn't have anything to drop either. Well, now that I have a rifle, I can make these shots without any issue. Watch. Like that. Fuck me. Fuck me. Fuck me. That took way more shots than it should have. The game makes you go all the way back. Of course it does. Spires are way too fucking big. I don't care what anyone says. Spires should not get that big anywhere outside of the rainforest. Oompa instead of yourself. It's nice, I will never complain about that. I can definitely go ham with the handgun. Or should I say I can go hand with the ham gun? Wow, the ins Oh no, wait, yeah, of course the fucking cabinet is there. The cabinet is what the Santa Claus throws Leon into to fucking knock him out. So yeah, of course the it's gone. It's kind of it seems kind of weird for it to be gone. I'm used to it being there, but it shouldn't really be that surprising. All right. Treasure, is there anything in here? Um, there is that way, but I don't know if I'm going to be going that way yet. Alright, I see you boys. I could quite literally see you as you popped in. Agarralo! 
<laughs> works every time. 60% of the time, it works every time. Oh, wow, that's a lot of you boys. Here, take this. Fuck. That was incredible. Shock, it's a shotgun shell just laying in the middle of the open like that. Why is there stuff just laying in the open like that? That's so incredibly bizarre. Everything I've opened before is still open, so... you had anything because of course not making me backtrack when I just left is really playing havoc with my mind oh he's wearing Leon's jacket what the fuck oh hello there are a lot of you alright here I got just the thing for that Take that, all of you. Yeah, I'll absolutely take another gold. I'm not gonna give that shit to you. You are literally the only guy left, I think. Wow. I might not have any grenades, but that one grenade was probably the most efficient use I would ever get out of a grenade. Like, ever. This looks like Leon's jacket. Why does he have a head here? But, oh no, he does have a head also. Okay, even though I, bla I should have hit him with enough force to blast his head off. 
All right, did they respawn a treasure when I went through here? No, they did not. Okay, cool. Fucking driving me crazy. Oh, sorry, Ada. I got rid of all your grenades. You're out of luck here. Are you serious? That guy has an actual rifle. What? At least it looks like it with this fucking ultra low quality graphics. I was caught completely off guard by that. I hit that the last possible second. Oh, hello. put the yellow cat's eye away though so I think I'm gonna be getting that back oh no well. fuck well gives me an excuse to use this at least yeah 
it seems like a lot of these enemies are literally just copy paste enemies of what you have in Leon's story. Not you, you are not there normally. see if I can go into the big keys' barn and get anything there. Damn, Merchant's not even set up, shut up, set up shop here yet. Wait, Ada, are you telling me that you actually do need to end up there? Um... Yeah, I guess you do at some point. Huh. Well, let's go then, I guess. It's kind of fun because I've only ever played this once and it was like four years ago. And I don't really remember... The only thing I remember is just being really fucking disappointed and not being able to upgrade any weapons. Oh, hello, stranger. Iron key. All right, cool. That might be what I needed. Welcome. Hello. Got if you're selling the TMP, I might have enough it. to get that. Is that all? <laughs> Thank. <sighs> Thank you. Is that all? <laughs> Thank. You. What are you buying? You still have the TMP on sale. Is that old? So I'll buy that. <laughs> what are you buying? You don't have anything else you're selling, do you? Come nope, nothing else that I can use. Time. The ultra long range scope is basically useless. Oh. Well, I'm gonna hope that the iron key gets me into the big key Santa Claus boss arena. And then I can find the actual key to operate the lift there. What stats do the TMP have right off the bat? I can put in 100 bullets, and I have 100 spare bullets for it as well. Okay, nice. I saw something flashing. So this is before Leon gets here. the shotgun shells to be low. Huh. 
That was... What, it was like a mini boss battle, I guess? It wasn't a full-on boss battle. It was like a mini boss battle. But at least that was new. I was about to start becoming really disappointed if every location is just a copy pasta of all of Leon's enemies. But, uh... No, that was most definitely new. Satisfying seeing her kick those doors open. I'm more of a chest guy myself, but I can absolutely appreciate legs. Are you gonna try and hit me with it, or are you gonna try and blow up in the face? Oh, no, uh-uh, no, 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 no. Alright, you gonna try and blow it at me, or are you gonna try and hit me in the face? Of course you don't have anything to draw. Oh, hello! story at least it seemed like if i knocked guys to hold and dynamite down i just had to like wait until a bit of time elapsed and then it would automatically blow up in their hands gonna line up like this there's no reason for me to not do that all right you come on down here buddy Welcome. You're still chilling here? Okay. Got a selection of good. What are you selling? I don't think I have anything to sell, do I? No, I do not. What are you do, I have any, do you have anything I can buy? No, you do Come not. Okay. Anytime. Hoggers. Why is that cutscene uh, decent and not muddy? I'm not upset. I'm happy that it's not muddy, but, um, seems really odd for that. Because it's the exact opposite of what we saw in Leon's story, where in the tower where you have to break the shoot three blocks and then get the thing to turn around. 
that was like super muddy, but that was, I don't know, it's fucking weird. So which way do we have to go between these two? I have to go through the El Gigante route. Oh boy. Oh boy. This could be fun. You have anything to say if we go- How in the fuck did you get here before me? Selling something new on this side of the stuff, stranger? No, are you, you are not. Come back anytime. That thing is loud as fuck. I can hear it all the way over here. Open. More TP ammo, I will take that. Probably the only thing you got for me over here. Okay, well, if this is gonna be an El Gigante, I have 275 rounds of TMP ammo. I can hook shot over it. That's cool. Can't drop an El Gigante on me. I see a shiny. God, you walk so stiff. It's a treasure that I'm like almost standing right by, so. Okay, well, there's that. So I've already been there. There's a house of some sort here. I don't think I can hook shot onto it. Handgun ammo here. I'm just waiting for a fucking El Gigante to show up and just fucking check my shit. They're drop. They're throwing a lot of shit at me as well right now, which is adding to my paranoia. Are you serious? How has this happened? Okay, well, I can ditch. I do have a regular green herb, so I can use this red herb right away. I need a bigger case ASAP. There it is! I fucking called it.
granted, Ada's base TMP definitely has more weapon, more uh, stats than the TMP that Leon buys initially. But like, holy crap, that was borderline pathetic. All right, well, here we go, I guess. Why do you walk so stiff, Ada? I forgot some. You guys go on. Louis. Louis. It's Luis, but. Hey, senorita, you got a light and some smokes to go with it to make my day? Where is the sample? Okay, we skipped the foreplay. As a matter of fact, I was just going to get it. Where's the love, baby? Sounds like fun to me. Just hurry up. Okay, lady. Where do you stand on all of this? Exactly what kind of group are you working for? There are some things in the world better off not knowing. This is one of them. <laughs> Fine. I can take a hint. I don't care who you are. As long as you get rid of that old man and his religious friends. <sighs> Among all the people involved in this, Luis Oh, it's Sarah. just this, it's, it's the exact same thing. Yeah, it's the exact same thing that I already played earlier. Alright. I mean, in that case, uh... Yeah, sure, I'll save. That was... That was easy. The first chapter was, like, short. The second chapter was a bit longer, but still relatively easy. Alright, we'll do this third chapter, and then we'll end this episode, and we'll immediately go into another episode afterwards. Put your hands where I can see them. Sorry, but following a lady's lead just isn't my style. Put them up now. Try using knives next time. Works better for close encounters. Leon. Long time no see. Ada. So it is true. True? About what? True? About what? You. Working with Wesker. You. Working with Wesker. I see you've been doing your homework. Why, Ada? What's it to you? Why are you here? Why'd you show up like this? <laughs> For a pair of glasses, that's a lot of See brightness. Ada. If sunglasses are used to like make things a little darker, are those like moon glasses to make things brighter, I guess? Luis has succeeded in recovering the sample. He's waiting in the castle. Get in contact with him ASAP. Understood. And that U.S. government lapdog, Leon. If you do happen to encounter him, put him out of commission. We can't let him interfere with our plans. He has no idea what's going on. He's nothing we need to worry about. He's a survivor of Raccoon City. We can do without the extra distraction. Take him out. <sighs> Leon. Retrieve the sample. Okay. Jesus Christ, stranger! Were you just standing there staring at me awkwardly the entire time? Again? Welcome. You really have a habit of doing that, and it's really weird. Good. What are you selling? Uh, you know, stuff and things. Ah, 
<laughs> Is that old? <laughs> what do you buy it? Is that old? <laughs> Is that old? <laughs> Thank you. Thank goodness, I need that. You don't have another what? I have the bow gun. I don't have Come what it takes to do anything time. with the bow gun yet, though. But I do know that I'll need it eventually. Boom, just like that, all of a sudden, I have room. It's incredible. Fuck, there's gonna be a bunch of dogs in this. I'm not looking forward to that. Ada is like, paper thin. Oh, okay, I can deal with you at least. Are you serious? Now, now I have a lot more room. Yes, please. Thank you. Fuck off. Fuck off. Let's reload this real quick also while I'm thinking about it. Matalo!
Wow, holy slow down that man. Oh, I see you, buddy. There are no dogs. I fucking hate dogs in this maze. I hear you. I'm coming. I'll, I'll find you and I'll kill you. I'll find you and I'll kill you. It's like Sadler only sent the guys with Plaga. I think almost everyone I've killed here have had Plaga. Come on. Show yourself. that uh, let's reload everything I have every reason to go ham on the fucking rifle for a bit so uh, also treasures anything left in here no there's nothing of value I've left in here so let's get the blazes out of here actually 
what I should do is I should sell this pearl thing now. Ooh, nice, I can use that. So I'll sell the pearl thing now to the merchant, because I only seem to come across him about once per chapter, so I might not come across him again. So let's sell this and get this off my inventory now. What are you selling? Not much, just ah. gold bangled pearls. <laughs> Thank you. Still don't what have enough to it? for the bow guy. No, I do have enough. But I don't think it will fit anywhere that will it? This takes up a ludicrous amount of space. Yes. Yeah, just in general, this thing's not good for inventory management. <laughs> I'll make it work, though. Okay, first things first, let's start being a lot more aggressive when it comes to using all of my weapons. I don't need to save ammo by knifing everything. Let's shoot, if I can shoot. bottle up there that would be like a spinel okay so check the map again where do I have to go I can go this way, I have to end up there, or I can go that way. Either way, I have to end up there. So let's go both routes. We'll just double back. Dessert to cherish our remaining years. I'll admit dessert sounds good right now. Fuck. 
buff off. trouble right now. Fuck off! Come on! How do you end up outside? Come out here where I can deal with you on my terms, buddies. I can't actually do damage to you <laughs> through the bars. That's that. Uh, well, that take care of, took care of my inventory problem, to say the least. Oh, there's more of you. I'm sorry. Should have come a little earlier when I was giving out fucking curtains for cheap. Nope. Any more? No? Is that it? All right, I've got I've got more hurt to give out, but Let me check something. Well, I guess we need to look for uh, hourglass then. No clue where we'll find one of those. Well, let's see if there are no D Vista doors in this. No, definitely not. Okay. I don't know why the game is giving me so much rifle ammo. I do, because for whatever reason, the game just in general 
prefers giving out rifle ammo over anything else. But... Do I even have anything to sell? I don't think I do. No, I do. What are you buying? But you don't have anything to sell to me, though. Yeah, you have a scope, but the scope means jack shit for me, so. I guess that's really the only way left I have to go, so let's do it, I guess. This. I have I have so many rifle bullets in here to blow. Fuck you. Fuck off. You get the knife. Need some health. Don't want to use what I have right now, though. I shoot you from in here. Well, from out there, I should say. This <laughs> has a magnum for a leak on, but there's the hourglass that I need for in there. Back to having no inventory space. Are you telling me that Ashley has the skills to open that door, but you don't, Lee Ada? That is like. That goes past being bizarre and just being ridiculous. Really? It's not like we see Ashley running around with something that would make her the master of unlocking. Do I see someone down there? I do not. Ridiculous, Ada. Nice. Um, I'm actually going to use this now. Fuck it. Might as well. What I really need is to either burn through some of this ammo that I have, or a bigger case. Either would be fine.
So I guess Cannon Lee and Leon does use the TMP? Leon, I'm sorry, but I can't be seen with you. Matalo! Oh my god, game! I do not need this much rifle ammo. Sell this fucking, these fucking rifle bullets. Fuck this. I am selling. What is in there? I'm selling 12 rifle bullets before I do anything else because this has just gotten ridiculous. Yeah, hello, stranger. Got a selection of good. What are you selling? Is that all straight? <laughs> that come back, edit. That should give me some room back, right? Yeah, that gives me room back. All right, cool. Let's go. Die. Wow, where did you come from? Shells are down here then, real quick. Do you have anything to say if you go to the left here? If they don't see me now, I'd have to finish them off. Jesus Christ, Lily, you are fucking fucked. You don't have any treasures that we've missed, do you? Well, apparently you have missed something. What the hell? What did you miss, Ada? 
Oh, elegant chessboard. All right, nice. You've not missed anything else now, have you? No, that's it. All right. Let's get to it. Excuse it. It's a flash grenade in the middle of a fucking archway. I don't hear Ashley in here. No, I do. Oh, okay. Leon, I got it. Lewis, Lewis, Lewis. I have the sample. You serve me no purpose. Sadler! My boy Salazar will make sure you follow the same fate. Stay with me, Lewis. I am a researcher hired by Sadler. He found out what I was up to. <laughs> Don't talk. Here. It should suppress growth of the parasite. The sample. Sadler took it. You have to get it back. Lewis! Lewis! Unfortunately, a bit too late. Did you retrieve the sample? No. Sadler has it. Hmm. There will be another time. Have you had a chance to eliminate Leon? Not yet. If that's the case, then maybe we can capitalize on his little lucky streak. Take advantage of the distraction he is causing for Sadler and his followers to retrieve the sample. All right, well, that's that. Jack Krauser has been the subject of extensive study and research by the organization. His skills and personality have been tested both on and off the battlefield. If he weren't the best, he would become a liability that would jeopardize the rest of us. My conclusion? He's a great soldier. No more, no less. As long as he's well compensated, he shouldn't cause any problems for us. If he does start to get restless, I can take care of him. I've studied his combat style and can deal with that arm of his if necessary. Krauser answers directly to Wesker, and it was Wesker who decided that Krauser should be sent to spy on the cult. He also decided to send me along. I wonder if it wasn't to keep an eye on Krauser. No doubt, Krauser has already fallen to the temptation of Las Plagas and the power they represent. This could have dire consequences for the organization. On some level, however, this may be a necessary development, as his role is to disrupt this farce of a play. That said, the stage and its players will ultimately come crashing down in the end. Bad luck for him.
But he'll play the patsy in the end and take the fall for all of us. That's why I need to make sure things keep going exactly as they are. Literally just a text elaboration of what's already been said. Yeah, let's save. And with that, that will bring us to an end of our first three-fifths of Ada's story. I'll end this episode, then start a new episode, like in four minutes. That will be the latter half of Ada's story.